Jason, what's your review told you about um, the game against Scotland that, that you need to work on this week? Yeah, real physical battle as we expected. Uh, probably one of our toughest contact areas and, um, against Scotland. They were awesome. I thought they showed some good innovation as Recording we previewed. In progress. Mm, nice. Okay. Um, <laughs> as as we previewed, and yeah, I think we showed some. You know, the the game had some good momentum shifts, and some were going in our favour, and some weren't pretty clearly. But um, we learned from that, and I think that you know where we came from in that test and got our way out of it and finished. I thought our bench was a real difference for us. So it was probably some uh, some good learnings we took on for today. Are the, the lessons there that you can take on board to ahead of what's going to be a tough test this weekend as well? Yeah, I think so. I think um, you know, we're winning and learning at the moment, so um, we, we're seeking to improve and we know it'll be a good step up for us this week and we're really looking forward to that as well. Change in referee announced today with Machi Ronal taking over. I guess your reaction to, to that, does that change anything from your perspective? No, not really, no. Jason, can you remember watching the World Cup semi-final 2019 against England? Yeah, I was on the stand actually. Yeah, no, I do remember watching that. What did you make of England that night? Um, yeah, they were pretty good, weren't they? Played well. Do you suspect they're a different team now? Or are you thinking they'll, they'll come at you much the same way they did three years ago? Yeah, I think they're a different team. I think we're a different team as well. I'm really looking forward to this next test match. Um, we haven't used any language around it being our last one. It's just our next one. So we're looking forward to playing it to them, yeah. Sure, say Jason, a big forward pack, and that you know like to use their set piece and come hard th through the, through the middle. Yeah, expecting, I guess, that traditional blueprint. Yeah, play to their strengths. Got a lot of good ball carriers, haven't they? Um, Cole Sinclair and Genge, they, they're real, you know, energy and um, great athletes around the park. Um, Mauro Toji, obviously, real leader in their line out. So yeah, they got they got strengths all over the park. Cody, what are your um, Experiences, recollections of playing England. Um, uh, yeah, it's it's tough. There's a real armour. So I think uh, first time, obviously, we got the job done, and then 2019 is a bit of a well, not the greatest memories. But um, yeah, again, they like Jace touched on their forward pack um, really sort of sets up the way they want to play, and, and I think it'll be much the same this week. Do you, do you feel um, not just since then, but particularly this year, that the four packs made a lot of gains, um, uh, improved, um, and, and really, I guess, could relish what England bring? Um, oh, yeah, definitely. I think uh, you know us as us as forwards. Uh, the great thing about our unit is that everyone's willing to learn and um, take on. I suppose. Uh, yeah, all those learnings we get each week every time we go out there and, and then beside me is really added to, to I suppose, the All Blacks and, um, you know, the, the good thing about Jason is that he's always uh, wants to be better and, and that's contagious for us as a forward pack and he squares us up when he needs to and, um, you know, also tells us what we're doing well as well, which is awesome.